I realised I was actually medicating my anger. But my blood runs cold when I think back to the stuff I did when I was out of it. Anything I could lay my hands on. Booze, heroin. I smashed up a brand new BMW 850i. The hookers I was with, well, they must have been psychic, because they jumped out five minutes before I wrapped that thing around a tree. Doctor told me I'd suffer three tendons in this arm, broke this wrist. Got up, went to the nearest bar, like some crazy latter-day dandy, ordered a double jack, and racked up a line of the devil's dandruff. Oh, thank you, Jeff. That sounds harrowing. Oh, it was, my friend. Would anybody else like to share any similar... Tommy? Yeah, no, just listening to Jeff's story. Uh, brought back some bad memories for me about when I was so high on drugs and fat from pies, I went out and drove over a puppy. A really cute one, and then I ate it. Uh, and then I was thirsty. I ended up drinking the acid from my car battery. Um, and I, I was tripping so much, I actually uh, fell into some farmyard machinery. Uh, now, that was harrowing. I severed all the tendons in my head, shoulders, knees and toes, and eyes and ears and, and mouth and nose, but, but crucially, my, my head, shoulders, knees and toes. <coughs> knees and toes. And the doctors who were charged with uh, reattaching the tendons on, on my head uh, botched the job because they were high on drugs too and they unbelievably stitched my head on back to front. So whenever I tried to move forward, I end up taking two steps back. Tommy, you don't want to take this seriously. And, shamefully, I stole a live dolphin and used it as a bong, smoking through the blowhole. <laughs> so, uh, who's won the competition? What competition? You know, the, uh, I'm dead interesting because I was the baddest behaved person on drugs competition. There's no competition, Tommy. This is very important to Jeff. Yeah, this is actually very serious for me. I was living on the edge. Well, you were living on the edge of Windsor. Shine on, you crazy diamond slash financial advisor. Hang on a minute, you hippie hey, prick. Don't take I... it personally, dude. Just keep it in perspective. You used to be a total dick, now you're just a bit of a dick. Welcome to Dick Club. <laughs>